And hello, YouTube, and welcome back to another episode of The Zone TV Movie Entertainment. With me, your host, Jonathan, once again, bringing you my thoughts and movie review for the brand new James McAvoy film, Speak No Evil, starring him, James McAvoy, and Mackenzie Davis. Now, apparently, this is in a, a foreign film remake. Never seen it. Saw this trailer. Thought, okay, cool. I really like James McAvoy. I think he's a great actor. Loved him in Split. Loved him in, obviously, you know, as Professor X. So, the guy's great. So, let's talk about Speaking of Evil. So, this movie tells the story of Mackenzie Davis, who's a mother, a wife, and her and her husband, they, they go on a little bit, you know, a little vacation. They end up meeting James McAvoy's character and his wife and his son, and they bond, they have a good time, they enjoy the weekend together, and then they're like, hey, why don't you guys come up next weekend to our place and hang out with us, see the other side of the country. Now, apparently, they're all in London, so this is like another maybe an hour, maybe two hour drive from them. So they're like, no problem. We'll go hang out, get some drinks, have some eat, to eat, hang out at your crib, our kids can play. Everything seems right, right? No. Apparently, things go kind of crazy when James McAvoy's character pretty much starts acting a certain way that he did in public versus how he acts at home. And it freaks out Mackenzie Davis's character and her husband and their daughter and it freaks them out. And um, it goes nuts from there. Look, if you've seen the trailer, you know what this movie's about. James McAvoy literally steals the show in this movie. I think he don't, I think he did a great job playing um, not a split personality kind of a character, but more of a kind of a psychological psychopath who's also a liar. It's in the trailers. It's nothing to spoil too much. But there are some things in here that happen. I'm like, well, that makes sense from what I saw from the trailer. Because I kind of guessed it right away, like, what exactly is going on here. And as you watch in the film, it, it gets clearer and clearer as you watch it. I thought make, I thought uh, James McAvoy was fantastic. I thought the kids, you know, the son and the daughter, you know, no relation to each other. But I thought their kids were very good playing off each other. So they did a really good job. I thought James McAvoy, is, the actress who plays his wife, was great. My only problem about this film, besides the fact that it's kind of like, wow, this couple is kind of stupid kind of a situation. It's just that I feel like Mackenzie Davis's character, and I love Mackenzie. I think she's fantastic. Um, I feel like her character was kind of stupid as well because there were some things in here she did that made no sense in here. And then she turned a total switch near the end. It's like, Oh, now you're starting to realize certain things. I'm like, okay, okay. Overall, I thought the film was fine. Nothing really to brag too much about here. But I thought it was just an okay film. Um, but yeah, McAvoy was fantastic. I liked the kids. And this, the plot of the film was like, oh, uh, so that's what they're doing. Kind of a, kind of a plot. That makes sense. Because when you watch it, you're like, what's up with this family? Like, like. Like, you can literally put it together, like, as soon as you see the family and how they act, as soon as they get to their own home. It's like, uh, is it going to go this way? Is it going to go another way? Nope. It went the way I was thinking. Yeah. And um, it was kind of like a little, little bit of a letdown in a way. But I still thought it was fine. So, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you guys thought about this. Are you guys looking forward to seeing Speak No Evil with James McAvoy? Do you like James McAvoy as an actor? Uh, leave me a comment below. Let me know. Stay tuned for more. Thank you very much. And have a good night.